Bullying is a widespread problem in our schools and communities. The behavior encompasses physical aggression, threats, teasing, and harassment. Although it can lead to violence, bullying typically is not categorized with more serious forms of school violence involving weapons, vandalism, or physical harm. It is an antisocial behavior that is learned through influences in the environment, namely home, school, peer groups, and multimedia. As such, it can also be unlearned, or better yet, prevented. What if it's in your hair? Are you gonna leave me alone? Oh my god, I don't want to do this anymore. Yes, yeah, so so oh, oh my god. Let me have this. No, no, give it to her. No, my mom gave it to me. Get off of me. She doesn't care. I'm obligated to you. I want this. This shirt is disgusting. So what is a bully? A bully is someone who directs physical, verbal, or psychological aggression or harassment towards others with the goal of gaining power over or dominating another individual. What is a victim? A victim is someone who repeatedly is exposed to aggression from peers in the form of physical attacks, verbal assaults, or psychological abuse. They generally do not have many, if any, good friends and may display poor social skills and academic difficulties in school. You're reading at a third grade read level. Come on, please. Come on. Let's go. I know how to read. Well, then read right. Profound misgivings. As Are you going to read right? Can you just let me read? Just read them. That's and do I it do. right. Speak up, too. A nuclear weapon on actual living people since 1945. So, so just. Come on. <laughs> hey. Can you let me go? I mean, like, you'll take forever on that one word. I'm just saying. Okay, because you're taking forever. Yo, can somebody get her? No, can you read right? Oh, I'm not doing this no more. All right, I don't care. But I, I, I got, got you, I got you. I wanted to bring Dom out here because you know that that was not right. The way you're okay, but he couldn't read. I'm not going to sit there and lie to him. I'm not going to sit there and talk about me like that. But, but, but if listen, you want to read, I want to read. Listen, listen to the point. Everybody's not going to be able to read at your level. And you're going to have to accept that. But not talk about somebody else who's at a lower level than you, alright? Okay, so we're just going to trip over every word in the book and not be able to get done before class is but over. You no, listen, if he don't ever get to read, he'll never get any better. And this is what I want you to know. Regardless how much he's talking about you, don't let that distract you from doing whatever like you're doing. Like There's a few words back here. Can you read them? Whatever. Listen, all your life, right, there's going to be some people picking on you, trying to tell you you can't do something, all right? But don't let them little distractions get to you, all right? Pick your head up, man, and keep reading. The more you read, the better you're going to get, all right? All right. Teachers play a vital role in the prevention and diffusion of bullying. Teachers identify and respond to potentially damaging victimization as well as to implement positive feedback and modeling to address appropriate social interaction. Let it get to me. That's the thing. I just say whatever, and I just laugh. And when you not, when they see that it got to you, that's when they do it more and more and more. People find anything to to try and you know like make them try and separate you from everybody else. else. They just so used to what they're used to, and they don't like open up with other people. And where are you from? New York. So and I was just around like all different races, and out here it's just like. You Indian, I'm not, I'm gonna pick on you and I'm gonna sit on the other side. I, I'm Somali and I wear like clothes that are Somalian, I talk different and a lot of people just like teach me because of that but I just avoid it, I be like, so what? It's my race, you follow yours and I follow mine, you know? Right, always hitting him, messing with him, He's, picking on him and he does, and if he does the same thing back, it could be bullying each other both ways, you don't have necessarily have to always be scared. Some kids actually don't bully you, right? just right? attempt to bully you, they just do it just for fun, for the other kids to laugh. So you don't have to fall for it. You just have to know, like, hey, you just avoid it or just try to forget about it. It's not, it's not always easy. physical bullying, you know, yeah, it's, it's emotional joke. and mental, like, it's, there's, there's always more to it. To me, if you bullying somebody, I just basically get your point across saying, you know, I'm bigger than you, I'm better than you. 
Just no. So when you bully somebody, remember you do it, it makes it make something look good, right? So there'll be other people around. So if somebody's sitting right there, there's gonna be a bystander. And if you're getting bullied, most likely if somebody have heart and your friends, it doesn't matter if you're friends or not, if you have heart, you will stand up for the person getting bullied. Like you're not gonna nobody gonna sit there, I'm not gonna sit there and trash you, nobody else around. You do when you bully somebody, normally everybody's around. <laughs> Did she just go past without saying nothing? <laughs> she mad, she got my leftover, my exes, and you know. <laughs> For real. Cyberbullying is any type of bullying that is carried out by an electronic medium. Text message bullying, picture and video clips, phone call, email bullying, chat room, instant messages, and social networks, the most prevailing of which is Facebook. Oh, snap, so you see what girl he just put? What'd you say, man? Read it, go ahead, read it, read that. 25 Five likes and I'm gonna expose Corey. What? <laughs> Crazy, ain't it? Like it, like it. Where'd she get that from? Like it, <laughs> like it, like it. Mm. That's great, that was posted something about you on Facebook, about the 25 likes, it's gonna expose you. Which one? Right there, it's the bro, the bro. Yo, why you yo, why you yo. do that? Why you do that to my man? Why did I do that? What you got on the phone? I heard that she was writing something about me on Facebook. Sure, sure, What's up? sure. What's up? Sure. What's up? 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 Why you want to get out of my face? What's your problem? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you want to do? 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 What do you want Yes. I mean, like, it's just on the, on the phone like a few minutes ago. But I don't know what's going on. I never, you know, get on my Facebook. Facebook is like nothing to me. So what you think happened to it then? I don't know. I probably got hacked. Who knows? Like Somebody else their password? Probably. probably. <laughs> Who knows? But I never did anything like that. Well, I'm sorry. I'm not my, that type of person. How my people's reacting towards you now? It's cool. Good job. They know that. Try about these? Sure. Oh, okay. <laughs> Give me a hug. Oftentimes, when handled delicately, most bullying situations can be absolved. With the use of effective communication and intervention, a problem is less likely to prevail. I don't want to be teased. I don't want to be teased. I don't want to be made fun of. <laughs> I don't want to be made fun of. I don't want to be talked about. I don't want to be talked about. Bullying is wrong. Bullying is wrong. Treat people the way you want to be treated. Treat people the way you want to be treated. Treat people the way you want to be treated.